Hello guys, welcome back to the channel The Techie Guy and today we are starting our new video of Python so it is the video of IPA 15 marks question so let's directly jump to the question so here question statement is write a python code to check if an string input string only consists of character presents in another given input string or not so code is very simple okay but uh, there is a trick okay to solve this question maybe some of you has a problem so let's check the further question so code will take as two inputs and check if the first input string consists of only characters present in the second input string or not if yes then program will print the message input string is valid without the quotes followed by the first input string in a separate line okay otherwise the program will print the message input string is not valid without the quotes followed by the first input string in a separate line okay so example if example first okay if input strings are how and how are you this is not the how are you this is how are you okay so output will be string is valid and how okay means the s1 okay now put all searches string comparison should be case insensitive that means uh, uh, capital a and small a there is not any difference and these are the some instructions okay so uh, let me just uh, show you one more thing so we don't have uh, maybe i think input output so yeah so let's directly come to the inputs of this question so the first line of the input is the main section and uh, we have a second line so for input how and the second input how are you we have to check is h o w how is present in second string is not and in this case it is present so our output should be input string is valid and how and in second sample output i am good okay and here is giving who i am okay if you really imagine this then i is present m is also present am okay so it is always be character wise okay that means there there is not comparing one word by word we are comparing it by character by character okay so here is who and here is good so h is also not present here and w is also not present here hence is input string is not valid and i am good we have to print so that we have to print s1 okay so now let's directly come to the so solution so for this uh, i am using online jdb compiler which is similar to your tcs ip compiler okay just uh, go here and choose your language in which language you want to code i am coding in python since it's an python ip question okay for java guys i will say check the telegram since it is not in different one so simply taking two inputs okay so str1 and str2 is of my second two basic inputs okay now i am looping but what wait a minute let's check it out look where we have to compare we have to compare first string with second okay so for that comparison look here this is capital okay and this string is whole small so what we can do we can take both strings as lower okay so this will be a good practice since all of the strings are case sensitive so we can take this and uh, taking res is equal to false here okay i am taking it as this because we have to check result also okay and right now i am using for loop so for word in and which string we have to compare we have to compare with uh, s1 okay so str1 okay dot i'm using split function to get words of this okay and coming inside it pressing tab once time so we get, can get inside this okay and now for ch means character in word so we are inside word here now two time step so we can get into the this type if now i'm using if condition if not okay if not ch dot lower okay 
इट मीन्स एफ सी एच नॉट लोअर और सी एच मे बी बिकॉज वी हैव कवर्ड ऑल दिस लाइक वी हैव कन्वर्टेड दिस थिंग इन टू लोअर केस एल रेडी सो वी कैन जस्ट सिंपली रॉट एफ सी एच इन इन वॉट एस टी आर टू ओके सो वी आर कंपेयरिंग विथ एस टी आर टू If it is present, okay, then just go inside and press three tabs, one, two, three, and change our result to true. So here I am making it true and using break here. Okay, since our work is done, so we are using break here. Okay, and uh, after this, just uh, come here for this loop okay and if our result is true okay so we can check if result is true then simply break since it doesn't mean to check every like word by word for everything okay and now here we use if result is true okay it means if result is true then we have to print input string is not present the input string is not valid okay and secondly we have to print s1 okay so str1 we have to print okay in this case else we need to print something which is print and then input string is valid and then we have to print what str1 okay so this thing is common and now we have coded this let me explain you what we are doing here so the main difference of the code is here okay here in this loop itself it is the main logic here so what we are doing let's jump directly first into the example so we have two inputs okay So let's carefully see this. We have two inputs. Uh, check. Uh, I think you can uh, understand with this example. Sure. So first string is how, and second string is how are you? Okay. So consider we have uh, here. So I am deleting this. So S one we have how. and s2 you all know we have how are you okay how are you okay and in this case what we are doing we are splitting in s1 so word only have right now this how only because it is an single entity if he has like how are also there then the word will splits in how first how then in r okay now ch what ch has ch has word in ch so word is how and ch is h okay and now we are checking this h in this okay all the things are case sense that if this h is not present okay if this result h is not present then we are declaring our result to true and breaking okay and if for word means if word means how we are checked this thing H O U. If one of these are not present here, and our result is true, then we are breaking the loop and printing our solution. Okay, so this is simple. I hope you understand. Okay, and uh, let's first uh, input our inputs. Uh, first input is how, and second input is how are you. So you can see my compiler is on X mode, so we can plot. Our two input here, and simply run this, and we'll check. Yeah, so string is valid, and how is coming out? Okay, and for second input, we are also checking. So first, uh, I am good, and who am I? Okay, so just click on input, and we are checking. I am good. Okay, so first is I am. and uh, second line of input is who i am i so who am i and i am going to run this 
and yeah input string is not valid and i am good is the answer as this suggests okay so i hope you understand all the logic behind this is here okay and we are using uh, only one super thing here which you can refer so all the logic is behind this we are iterating two times okay so if you didn't understand please repeat this video okay and if you have any doubts then you can just go to our channel and watch this playlist we have more of the things here you can get all the ipa questions of mcqs here you will get tcs tc which is an ninja to digital upgradation type playlist okay here is an nqt you can also watch this those are preparing for dc okay they, and these are java 15 15 marks question and these are java 5 marks question on and here you can mix of 15 marks python question and 35 marks python question Okay, bye. See you soon.